What's up, Chrono Clashers? Another match. This time it's Godzilla versus Naruto. Let's just get underway. Seven. Did you go first time? I go first. I wasn't paying attention. No, you went six. I'm okay. seven. Okay. You're so good at rolling dice. Always go first. No, I don't. No? It doesn't matter. You keep beating me anyway. <sighs> hey. So I got five cards in hand and then I draw yep. for turn. Draw for turn. I'm interested to see this one because this is the blue purple, um, the blue purple deck versus the red green um, kind of defensive deck in Naruto. And I feel like the blue purple deck is closer to a Naruto deck than any of the other, any of the other um, Godzilla decks. Sasuke, give me an EX card. So I'm just interested to see how so it plays out. So does this out. mean when I attack, everything else costs yeah, it's one? Always. Oh, always. Always. Then I will never attack. With never that. attack. All wait. Always. All of my actions. Action cards cost one. Yes. Yeah. Does this mean that it has elusive always? Yep. So you can't attack it? I cannot attack it. But it can get destroyed? It can get destroyed. If I were to attack yes. with it? Yes. But you cannot attack it? I cannot attack it. Well, I will play Godzilla's Invasion Ooh. for free. For and free? I'll, I'll tap my draft. Oh, okay. Tapping for three the draft. times. Nice. Then we we'll do And then I'll just play Godzilla. Godzilla, okay. And then for toughness, I'll play okay. this underneath. And? Oh, draw a card. Yes, okay, my turn. Draw. Well, I can't, I can't attack that. So I guess I'll attack your guardians. Ooh, good That's one time, okay. Well, to counteract that, I will play Sucker Ed Sarada. One, two. <laughs> then let's be annoying with Boruto. Get an EX card. And it's your turn. Ooh. Boruto is back at it again. Even Godzilla struggles getting rid of him. <laughs> Even Godzilla. Which I think is like kind of funny. Because like when we were playing Nar the Naruto only, it was like, it was always just like, oh, Boruto. Ugh. But even with Godzilla, I think especially so with that deck. You don't have a gravitational beam this time. Summon effect. Okay. All my my banner strands and okay. yours is tapped already, okay. so. Yeah. And then you have to tap something. Oh no, tap this for sentinel. Okay. Ha! See if your sentinel versus right. my sentinel. My turn. Well I guess the first thing to do would crash Boruto into that. Mm-hmm. And I'll attack your guardians with Sasuke. Six Destroy! Okay, he's dead. I get Legion though. It's a Haku. I get to put that in my hand. And then I'll just, you know, I'll just play the Haku. You know what? What? I think it's time to go questing. You think it's time to go questing? Ooh. Yeah, I'm gonna quest with Drat, cause it's not like...
This is actually a point of contention that I'm not sure about, but I just assumed it would never come up, is if, how does elusive work with questing? Because when you have the elusive thing, you can't attack the battler, but you're not really attacking the battler, you're attacking the guardian. So yeah. I don't know. And what about if it has toughness? If you have, it doesn't matter because you're attacking the guardian. You put it on top. Oh, on top, on top, yeah. sorry, sorry. Wait, so are you going to, so how, what do you think? What do you think? Because we're attacking the guardian, not the battler. Oh, and I'm just gonna play this for free. Okay. I get to draw anything from my discard pile, so okay. I'm just gonna take King Ghidorah. Okay. Yeah, oh, yeah, actually, can, can, I, can I interject really quick? Yeah. You take back Moguera, and what? then and then stand all the things that are quested so I can't attack them. Oh, that's so smart. Which is, I just think it's funny. But I don't know if you should do it, but I think no, it's funny. No, no, I want King Ghidorah. Okay, I want King Ghidorah. I want King Ghidorah, okay. And then, should I quest with my destroyer? I don't know. Let me know what you guys think in the comment about the elusive guardian, elusive questing issue. Yeah, I'm gonna go questing. Questing! It's the only way I can win. All right. Boruto's too annoying, right? And then, and then what do I do? Then I guess I will just play this. For nine? For nine. Okay. Oh, eight, nine. Ugh. I'll give you lots of time. How much guardians do you have though? I feel like you're about to die. Three. Three? Porto starts. <sighs> I shouldn't have started with Porto! <laughs> Plus one? I want a, want a guardian attack. Oh yeah. Yeah. Ooh. Choose anything in there and get it back. Mogura. Mogura, okay. And then um, I'm gonna play Orochimaru, who has fast. I'm gonna attack, and then I discard a card. The EX it's card. five. Bye bye. Bye bye. He attacks seven. He gets plus two strength. Oh, fine. This gets destroyed, and then I get an EX okay. card. But then I'm just gonna summon EX summon. And kapow! No! I should have played the Sentinel instead. <laughs> That was a good transition. It just was a little too slow. I should have started questing earlier. Dang, Boruto, back at it again. Give a thumbs up if you guys hate Boruto too. <laughs> just like she does. Comment down below and see, of course, any other matches, your favorite card. What do you think about questing? What do you think about the elusive questing interaction? Um, I kind of was assuming it would never come up because questing kind of is doo doo. But. You go for every once in a while. Yeah, when you slam down. When when Boruto, Boruto happens. When Boruto happens, sometimes it's your only option. Subscribe. Of course, we're gonna have more matches, more deck profile, more fun. And keep on learning. Have a wonderful day. See you in another video. Chrono Class Central out.